getting AI on your mobile device is the name of the game today. So we're going to walk through the steps to get um, Midjourney and Pika Labs onto your Apple phone as well as your Android phone. Uh, so straight into it. Right, so first up is getting Discord onto your phone. So search for Discord in your App Store or your iOS Play Store. Next up, go to Midjourney and sign in and log in if you haven't. And then the next thing is Pika Labs. Go into Pika Labs, sign up. And what we can do now is go into Discord. So log into Discord, put in your username and your password. Both of these accounts will be linked to your um, Mid Journey and Pika Labs. So as soon as you log into Discord, it should appear right away. And uh, what you can see here is the uh, interface. So this is your Discord interface. And if you click on Mid Journey, you can just slide across. And what we can do now is give it a quick test and a bit of a prompt. So prompting in Mid Journey is uh, forward slash imagine, and then your prompt. And um, if you'd like to get more information on prompts and how to make uh, better prompts, have a look at one of my other videos. Right, you can pop in an aspect ratio for a mobile phone it's 916 um, uh, 16 9 is for widescreen uh, what I thought I'd do is just to show you how to use a um, camera so what you can do is forward slash describe and take a photo and ultimately choose the image that you would like so give access to your images there's my photo and what we can do now is uh, hit enter and um, it'll then um, describe that picture for you. So this is gonna be great for going around um, uh, in your walks or whatever, take a snap and then ask, uh, um, uh, ask my journey to imagine it. Uh, so I've just clicked on imagine all here and it's what it's gonna do is it's gonna basically bring up a, um, a number of prompts that's gonna basically enhance my image, put another face on it and just give it, uh, give, something, give something cool. Um, so that's pretty good. All right, so it's generating. As you can see, it's quite quick uh, for four images. And you can see there that it's now taken a few things and made some uh, enhancements to it, which is great. Right, next up is Pika Labs, really quick uh, prompts. Uh, so Pika Labs is great for creating uh, moving videos. Um, so click on one of the rooms, so go to the generation room. And the way you would get started with Pika Labs is forward slash create and you can then type in your particular prompt. Um, so we'll just do a rushing waterfall um, with a mountain background over a mountain. That should be that should be pretty decent and it'll give you a, an idea of how to use um, uh, Pika Labs. Uh, if you want to check out more, have a look at one of my other videos. Um, the concept car video has got a bit more information ar around how to create um, moving videos for Pika Labs. And um, that, that, so it's basically created a uh, image. You can click on the play button and you can see the waterfall moving. If you like this, subscribe, hit the like button.